You feel like doing it? Yeah, let's do it. Hell yeah. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. <laughs> Sounds sweet. Uh, okay. uh, one on one, take one mark. Kind of, yes. Where? <laughs> uh, Here. Yeah. Yeah, maybe that was a felling. <laughs> maybe you just looked at your fellings. Alright guys, whenever you're ready. Sam! Hi. We uh, have a couple cameras. Oh. Wonderful. <laughs> Wonderful. Did you do this? <laughs> uh, you know, it's a fun idea. We had cameras available. There's no other shoots today. <laughs> you look great! <laughs> Let me put on my face. You look great! Um, yes. So. We the, have a good idea. We just wanted to start filming it now. So we have some like documentary style before they were famous. <laughs> yeah. Allie and I both have a lot of student loans. Crippling. And we work at a, uh, a comedy website focused on college. Uh, so we have an idea for you. The company comes up with crazy things for us to do. And if we do them, you give us money for our student loans. Like gotcha. jumping out of a helicopter. We have pull, 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 okay, pull, yeah, pull, yeah, pull. I have a bunch of stuff. Um, the idea is like student loans are such a nightmare. The next twenty years for us are just like kind of shitty every month, barely scraping by. And we're saying like, what if you like an accordion push that into just four months of like actual shitty, scary living, and then we're done. We owe so much money. Each month, it drains my bank account at least. I paid for a bell pepper in dimes just <laughs> this week. This is like a stunt show, mm -hmm. like a challenge show. Totally. In which we pay off your student loans. Yes. Yes. I like <clears throat> that you're calling attention to the student loan problem in a way that's very personal to the both of you and in a way that's really loud. Um, I think my initial concern would be that if you're putting me in the position of being your torturer, <laughs> like I have like a legal and ethical responsibility to you guys as your boss. And it's tough to put me in the position where I'm like, you know, inflicting this kind of pain on you. You know what I mean? But we're I mean, asking, unless, I mean, what if you guys challenge each other? So like you took turns giving each other a challenge and then if they failed, then the person who challenged gets the money, so that kind of raises the stakes a little yeah. bit. So on the one hand, you're pitching a show that's like literally to do with ruining your lives. And you're pitching a show that's to do with like paying off your crippling student loan debt. This is either a terrible idea on your part or like a brilliant idea. And I guess I'm like eager to see which, which it is. Interesting. <laughs> that sounds like a yes from daddy. <laughs> I mean, go, can you do one? Go do one. Greenlit. Hell yeah. Full series. Uh, Excuse me. All right, thanks again. Uh, yeah, well, I heard thanks full again. series. Thank you very much. I heard uh, full fo series. Follow us up very quickly while we have the full series order from yeah. Sam, <laughs> Sam, Sam Reich. Thank you, Sam. Gotcha, thank you, Sam. I'm scared for you, is that the last thing you said? <laughs> Good. Uh, yeah. Hell Great. yes. Yeah, but yeah uh, awesome. We'll meet later and figure out the Details? I feel like we just scammed the company. <laughs> <laughs> this is um, uh, someone I owe money to that they call from time to time. I, I simply will not answer this phone call. The total that I owe all in is $95,441.73, about $735 a month. That covers interest, basically. That, co that, 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 is, that is just the interest. You know, my parents didn't have any savings, and so I said, helpfully, well, why don't I go to a very expensive private school? Having debt like this, having any kind of debt, I, I gotta imagine, is so, it's so always in the back of your mind. You can, you can never get ahead. Something like this big, like an amount of money that's just so, Big, you, you, you can, I, you can, you're never ahead of it. You know, I'm gonna pay this off, maybe before I die. So, in addition to working at College Humor, I uh, have a job on the weekends waiting tables. I'm not embarrassed to have to wait tables. There is, I think, cognitive dissonance for people because I do have a, a good job in entertainment. You know, this is a job that is sought after. I'm very lucky to be working at College Humor, and so I think when people find out that I also have this. Uh, 
this job waiting tables, it can diminish me a little bit in their eyes. This is my car. I didn't have a car for a few years uh, because I couldn't afford one. But then I found this car for $500. Why was it $500, you ask? Oh, because it's leaking oil. What do I use to check the oil? A sock. Is it my sock? No. It was just in the car when I bought it. Oh yeah, she's dangerously low. This fell off of my muffler recently, uh, and I picked it up just in case I need it later. I owe about 60 grand. And this, like, I owe this much money after getting half scholarships for every year. I, like, worked super hard and applied, and I was, like, an RA at all these on-campus jobs. It feels really shitty to, to owe this much money. I just feel, like, constantly behind. Like, I came out of college, and I felt like I was doing it all right. Like, I went high school to college, got a degree, and I graduated, and then they were like, welcome, you are now, like, the shithead part of society that's in like insane debt. You have no credit. The only way to build credit is to get credit. Figure that one out. I don't know how people do it. Like I can't, it really feels like, like the myth of Sisyphus. I'm just like pushing this fucking rock up a hill and it's falling on me. That's truly the first time I've used my philosophy degree since graduating. I'm definitely like the more broke one of my friends. Uh, which I'm usually able to like keep under wraps. You can get a double shot of espresso over ice and then they always have milk out there on the counter for people to add to their coffee. You just fill up your cup with that milk, bam, you got an iced latte for probably $3. I saved $2.50, but then I spent $11 on oil. <laughs> There's gotta be a better way. All right, so the company has tentatively agreed to put forward about $50,000 in prize money towards your student loans for an entire season. We're going to do this first one uh -huh. to make sure it works. Okay. Uh -huh. We'll start out low, like 500 bucks for this first challenge, and then it'll work up to about 10000 for the final challenge. So the way it'll be structured is every episode will have two challenges. You will challenge each other. And if you fail the challenge that the pers other person gives you, they get that money. So in theory, that last episode, one of you could win 20, 20 grand. $20,000, oh my god. Uh, and because of this as a structure, like you guys have to really push each other to make these dollar amounts feel worth it. I'm Pay already brewing it. up ideas that are like too far even for you. I have some legal questions for you. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Can I get someone to hunt Grant? You have to commit a crime and go to jail. Grant has to drink. So <laughs> You have to tell your mom that you were wrong and you're not a lesbian. Oh, no! no. The other you have to make yeah. a test tube baby with someone that I pick. Fuck, <laughs> yeah. I mean, that does fit within the parameters. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. So I just have a kid? Now have that money's yeah, like, on can the I, line. Can I make Allie, like, cut off her finger? Whatever one <laughs> step below removing a pinky is, that sounds great. Like, if, if here's the ceiling, cutting off a pinky's right above it. <laughs> <laughs> so right now, I think Grant is going to have to be naked and interview a guy on student loans. Okay. Wait, Grant has to be naked? Yeah. Right. yeah. Grant loves being naked. It's supposed uh, to be a chat. It's supposed to be hard for you. Uh, oh, it'll be hard for me. Shut, uh, yeah. shut up! What I like about opening with an interview is we get some good information about student loans. Yeah, and yeah. I, I, I want to keep I, that part, but then you have to be doing something else with it. Is there something <laughs> Grant will hate more than being naked? Please! Yeah, like yeah, right. Peace! 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 Hang on. That's that's truly an impossible thing. You're already like scamming the company out of getting them to pay you money. You have to do something. Wait, what about leeches? Leeches. Leeches. Leeches and have them on your body and then take your blood. Leeches. Oh no. Yes. Yes. What about that? Cause that I guess is they safe. use it as medicine. I, I mean, I don't even know if we can do it in the office. We can. Oh, yeah, Raph we can. said we can. Allie's thing right now is eating spicy food, and my thing is- Really spicy food? So all you're doing is just eating spicy food. Right, I can eat Thai food. Give me my student loan. All right, it's suck. episode yeah. one. It's episode one. That is that is something. We do need a place to build to. All, yeah. I do think that what Grant is doing is like 
physically scary for him. Something in here has to be so uncomfortable that it's like... That it's on the level of a fucking leech. You have to interview okay, somebody. Okay, okay, okay. Do you have no, like... No, I'll like, um... A parent you're estranged from, or...? I... No. <laughs> but what if nightmare is <laughs> <laughs> was? Yeah, what if... Dad? Hi, Daddy. <laughs> Daddy. Do you have an ex that you don't talk to anymore? No. That's great. No. Yes. No. What about like a hero Shut or something that up. I would what about be nervous Dutch about? Girl? That's no, great. Stop it. Uh -huh. Wait, I don't know. Oh, what fuck. is your That's Dutch great. girl? Uh, it was a girl I dated in Holland. She's not my Dutch girl. Yes, you, the Dutch girl that got away. That's great. That's insane. When is the last time you talked to her? Like when you broke mm -hmm. up? Do you want well, this money or we not? We never break up. <laughs> I love her. Oh, I love her. Oh, I love her. Oh, oh, this is perfect. No, uh, no it's not. This is perfect. Okay, yeah, I cannot. I can't Skype her. Honestly, like. Ali, you have to, or I get your money. Your challenge is you have to call Mirta on Skype for. I don't know, what's a long time? You have to remain continent and emotionally engaged. <laughs> Is that true for both of us? Yes. For 30 minutes. For half an hour, we both have to do an interview while we're getting fucked by either leeches or spicy food. <laughs> <laughs>
second. Mm. Uh, what is the cotton in the nose for? To protect leech to go inside of your mouth. Yeah, sorry, I'm being awkward. Um, are you dating anyone? <laughs> um, I have a date with that girl the day after tomorrow. Reminds me so much of you. No, I... no. Uh, cool. What is, what is all that negative reporting on credit? What is all that debt doing to, doing to people these days? Financially, it prevents you from buying a house. Uh -huh. Your ability to get a car loan. Uh, your ability to rent an apartment. Yeah. But emotionally, you know, if you've got 90, 100, 200 thousand dollars worth of student loan debt, and you're getting called by debt collectors all the time, what does that do to you? I think I might be in Amsterdam this summer. Seriously? Mm. Oh, I think just for like, uh, like a week. <laughs> a week? Uh, oh, can you hold one second? I'm sorry. Motherfucker. Okay, we're good. <sighs> you were sold the dream, weren't you? I was. You were I sold was... the dream. That was moving on my face. Um, <laughs> yeah, I was living in Ohio when I was a kid, and you know, I was I I said, you know, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna be, <laughs> I'm gonna be an actor, and I went to acting school. I borrowed all the money to go to acting school, because uh, I because I had to get I had to get out of Ohio. Um, and now look at me. <laughs> oh, motherfucker. Okay, why did we broke up? I think we broke up because you were sad in Holland. You weren't really yourself. And I think that was a trigger for both of us. Not you being sad, but more the fact that you weren't really being at home here. Yeah. And I'm curious if you would live here or, or if I would live there if we would be together again. Yeah, same. I would live in Holland after I was like 60 on. Like to retire in Holland. I would go to Holland to die. <laughs> I already feel like I died in Holland. You're coming out of the gate and you're feeling like you screwed up before you started. I, well, I did screw up before I started. That is, that is the feeling that I have is like, well, there goes my financial future. I'm gonna pause again. I'm getting sure. a little bit more water coming out, coming out uh, over yonder. Thank you very much. She's, she's, she's done? Mm -hmm. Oh, she can, you can collect her. You have 30 minutes, man, you did it. So you're good. Oh. Great. So, That's great. Wrap up. <laughs> uh, in that case, uh, thank you so much, uh, <laughs> Jay Fleshman, for coming in. I think you would ever live here, and then we could be together. <laughs> I don't think I would ever live in LA. Oh, that's a hard truth. I think that's why we broke up, because we could never live in the same place. Like, yeah. We just happened to catch each other when we did live in the same place, but it wasn't forever. Yeah. <sighs> Which is shitty. Yeah. There's my jacket. Are you cold now? Yep. <laughs> I'm like, Fine. it's like I have a fever. Ellie, yes. you need 30 minutes. Yes! We're done. Oh, okay, yeah. thank you for doing this. No problem. It was a pleasure. <laughs> yeah, was it? It was. Good to see you. Love you. <laughs> Love you too. Bye. Bye. Yeah, same. Bye. 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 Ah. <laughs> oh. Grant. <laughs> no way. Okay. That was really bad. <laughs> oh, I can smell it you like look on you. I can smell it. You on look you. like American Psycho. I'm... Can I see it? Oh my God! Clotting agents. Ah! Oh my God! I am gonna barf. No! 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 <laughs> What'd Mirta say? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! I just wanted to show Sam what he greenlit. 
Is this Sam? Oh my god, Sam. Hey, buddy. You look horrible on the outside. Yeah. <laughs> you look horrible on the inside. It's true. I'll say this, you guys have proven that you are committed. Thank you. Great. That's great. <laughs> oh. Uh. I have like a like a very very bad headache. I feel that you look like you were murdered or murdered someone. TV right now to start your free trial and see Allie do this. Are you okay, man? I feel bad. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, 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 stop it! I didn't, I didn't do it! <laughs>